The organ rattled and raced along the track. The pipes clattered and clacked, but no music played. I must push fast. I must save it from the smelter's yard. The calliope rattled along in front of Percy, but still no music played. Then there was trouble. Percy was at the top of Gordon's Hill. He stopped, but the calliope didn't. The coupling had snapped. Bust my buffers! The calliope rattled and raced down the hill. With a crash and a bash, it smashed off the track. <laughs> oh, no. Percy felt terrible. The calliope is sure to be scrapped now. Percy sighed. Steam swirled from his pistons and whimpered from his whistle. Diesel <laughs> chuckled. That's the only music I've heard all day. <laughs> That made an idea begin to bubble in Percy's boiler. Wishing whistles! Now I know how to make the calliope play! <laughs> Percy's driver connected a hose from Percy's cylinder drain to the calliope. Steam shot into the organ. The calliope let out a rash and a pop and a wheeze. <laughs> but then, with a cough, and a splutter. It began to play. Percy beamed from buffer to buffer. Then Sir Topham had arrived. Percy, what is making that music? It's the calliope, sir. We were told to take it to the smelter's yard, but I got it to work. Well done, Percy. I am very proud of you. You have saved an important piece of Sodor's history. Percy peeped with pride. Take it to the steamworks. Victor will fix it properly. Yes, sir. At the steamworks, the calliope was painted and polished. The brass pipes gleamed in the sun. Percy puffed proudly. Everybody wanted to hear the calliope play. Percy fired his furnace, bubbled his boiler, and shot steam into the calliope. It was the sweetest sound on Sodor. Would you like to be one of my little helpers? How well do you know the engines on Sodor? Let's play Who's That Engine? If I give you some clues, can you tell me who this is? This engine has four big leading wheels and six even bigger driving wheels and a smart silver and black buffer plate. This engine has a rather unusual shape with a long, streamlined boiler, which helps it to go very fast. It has a very unusually shaped funnel and a whistle, which sounds like this. It belongs to the Duke and Duchess of Boxford and brings them to Sodor in its smart Pullman coaches. So, who's that engine? That's right, it's Spencer. Well done. I think you deserve my little helper's certificate. One day, Spencer was bringing the Minister of Transport to the island of Sodor to see how the railway runs. But on the way, Spencer was showing off. He rushed past Edward and was diverted onto the wrong track. When Spencer finally reached Knapford, he was very late. The minister was not impressed and said he didn't want to travel with Spencer again. All the other engines wanted to be chosen to carry the minister, and they hurried about 